What is organic farming? So what the heck is organic farming and how is it different than conventional farming? By definition, organic farming is simply not using any chemically based fertilizers or pesticides to grow your product. Another important decision to make about the safety and well-being of your crops is how to extend the shelf life once they're grown, especially if you're doing this for profit. Listen to what Mike Russell, a farmer from northern Pennsylvania, has to say. Good morning. I'm Rick Corwin, uh, owner of Quick Chick uh, Catering and Trailer Rentals at the moment. And this is Mike Russell, one of my customers from Brackney, Pennsylvania. It's a beautiful 40 degree day here in northern Pennsylvania. So why would anybody need refrigeration on a day like today, you might ask? But uh, Mike has been one of our newest customers. He's uh, uh, used our cooler trailers for everything from keeping his produce cold to his cider fresh and cold. So when it goes to the customer, it's optimal everything, temperature and taste. Um, Mike, what can you tell me about things out at the farm here? How have they been? Was it a good year for you at the farm? Yeah, the, we had a great season. Um, you know, we, we were blessed with a good crop of apples. We were busy the whole season long. Uh, did, uh, did it make your job any easier using cooler trailers this year for uh, for moving your stuff around and for keeping your produce fresh? Or? It uh, it was it, it certainly did. It was a huge advantage for us. We were able to actually put more product on the shelf. Um, our our, our main refrigeration is 20 minutes away, so not having any kind of refrigeration here at some of the remote locations that we do, having the cooler trailers was a great advantage because we could actually inventory product here, and we had it so we could put it right on the counter when we needed it. And uh, we could pallet load them, we could hand load them. Uh, it was very, very convenient for us. It actually extended the life on our cider because we could come right out of our cider room after we pressed the jug. We went directly into the cooler trailer press all natural raw cider doesn't have any chemicals or preservatives so yeah, uh, being able to keep that cold from the, the moment it was pressed certainly it, it, it extended the shelf life on it and uh, you know in the long run that made us more money how's how's the apple crop been this year though i see we still have some left on the thing it's the first of november why would anybody need to keep anything cold in central Pennsylvania in <laughs> November. <laughs> well, su surprisingly enough, uh, part part of, of the, the longevity of, of product is the variation in temperature, and, and having constant temperature, steady temperature, is uh, is an advantage for product life, and that includes something even that you wouldn't think like apples or uh, potatoes and, and even something along those lines. I mean, having the consistent cold is, is certainly a large factor in extending shelf life on uh, on our cider or apples and, and a lot of product that you may not think you may, may have wondered well why didn't i get the shelf life out of this that i would have expected why couldn't i keep that bag of potatoes as long things of that nature and it's because of the temperature swings so as the temperature varies the, it takes shelf life out of product so having the constant cold has been a great advantage for us with with our with our company like uh, we started off Early this last year, or early this year, you know, in 2014, we bought our first trailer from Tom early in the year and tried to decide how to get the thing shipped all the way from Ormond Beach, Florida, all the way to, to New York State. And it was tough for us, but we finally figured it out. And uh, we, we had quite a few customers your size, larger and smaller, call us for, for trailer rentals and for, I mean, catering, chicken barbecue. We used the, the trailer quite a bit ourselves. But in our off time, we were using that trailer for another stream of income. And uh, like you rented it from us, which was great. And uh, by the by the end of the summer, we actually ordered two more trailers. So <laughs> yeah. we have three of them on the ground here in New York and Pennsylvania. So yeah. like Tom says, it's, it's, a good, it's a good way to supplement your income. It's making you money while, while we're not using it. So. I was glad when you got the second one. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's about it from central Pennsylvania at the moment, so we'll be seeing Tom soon, and good luck.